Did you know that getting a shiny Tadbulb, one of the hardest Pokemon to see in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, is easier than ever? And in this video, I'm going to show you how to force spawn your shiny Tadbulb, and you don't have to worry about going to look for mass outbreaks or weird places that it might spawn, having to look for that little red tail. That's right, it's easier than ever, and I'm going to show you. All right, let's head into Peldea. So step number one. We're going to head to the Glacido Gym, and we're going to head to this specific spot I have here on the map. This spot here is the highest peak in Paldea. You'll know when you're here because it's marked by this lovely sign. Step number two. Once you're here, I need you to go ahead and throw down a save. We're going to be creating a sandwich, and I don't want you to waste any ingredients, especially that sweet, sweet Herba Mystica that we all have a hard time getting. All right, once you do that, you're good to go. Step number three. It's time to go ahead and throw down that picnic. So now that we're here, find a good spot that allows you to throw down a picnic and throw one down. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to make a sandwich. For this specific sandwich, we're going to need electric. So we're going to throw down one part yellow bell pepper, one part salty herba mystica, and one part spicy herba mystica. This is going to get us encounter power and sparkling power. Now, yes, different combinations definitely work. You are welcome to do whatever combination you want, but I don't want to hear you in the comments if you don't get encounter power. You have to have it. You need to have encounter power or this simply will not work. All right, once you've created your sandwich that has sparkling power and encounter power, you're good to go. Step number four, I need you to follow my path right here. We're going to be flying down the mountain to this specific spot right next to the waterfall. At this point, once you arrive here, you're going to kind of look over to your right side and you're going to see the Tadball begin spawning in. What you need to do is find a nice spot to where you can see them very clearly and go ahead and set up your camera. At this point, you want to use a combination of your in-game camera plus your Nintendo Switch camera. If you don't know how to do your Nintendo Switch zoom function, I'm going to go ahead and put that text right here on the screen right now. But you're going to be simply using your camera and in-game camera to look, in-game camera and Nintendo Switch camera to look at each Tadbulb spawn in. We're going to watch orange, 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 and we're going to be waiting until we get that beautiful red tail Tadbulb to spawn in for us. Now, once you see them stop spawning, go ahead and simply run back to where you are to the furthest point of the lip of the mountain. There's a little lip that you're going to be standing on. I need you to basically just run back until they despawn. You can be kind of looking behind you and you're going to run forward again until they respawn. And you're going to keep wash, rinsing and repeating this method until you get a shiny. It might take you a little while. It might even take you more than one sandwich, but your patience will 100% pay off. Because when you when it does pay off, you're going to get a shiny Tadbulb just like we got right here. That's right. Look at that beautiful boy. Look at that beautiful, look at that beautiful Tadbulb. Look at that beautiful red, red tail. That's right. Now you can enjoy one of the best shinies in the game. Why? Because it's so hard to freaking see. All right. If this video helped you out, throw us a like and throw us a subscribe before you leave especially if videos like this end up helping you get some shinies. All right, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.